while many of you experience shock, I'm in amazement. I'm amazed at how easily we can deny, how easily we can forget, how easily we move about in America, in this Western culture that we've developed, where we've made it very easy to not notice, to stay in our own lane, to mind our own business. We've made it really easy to forget how to befriend, mm. how to ask questions, how to get to know people. 7,000 followers and not one interaction. Not one interaction. That's how easily these tragedies will continue. That's how easily these events will continue. That's how easily the terrorists that will affect the America of today, tomorrow, and the future will continue unless we decide to do something else. We cannot continue to ignore each other. We cannot continue to overlook each other. We cannot continue to pretend this one doesn't exist or that one doesn't exist. I'm talking about your friends, your family, your followers, your co-workers. You move around in life on autopilot. You mind your business. You stay in your lane. You pay your bills. You acknowledge who you choose to acknowledge in your family. You acknowledge who you choose to acknowledge within your peer group. But then there's this whole other segment of society for which we've normalized ignoring. We ignore those who don't look like us. We overlook those who don't share our religious or our political beliefs. We overlook those who don't have what we have. We, don't, we overlook those who aren't cute. We overlook those who don't have something that we need or desire or feel we can immediately benefit from. And so we've normalized a subculture within a subculture within a subculture of people who will continue to be overlooked, who will continue to be ignored, who will continue to be denied, while the world makes rules and protocols and social mores to placate itself as if we are somehow going to just go away. We've normalized the acceptance of tragedy. We've normalized acceptance of shootings. We've normalized acceptance of violence. Why are you shocked? I'm amazed that you're shocked. Why, why would you not expect more of this? I'm amazed that you all still refuse to do something, to acknowledge something, to change something, to modify something. It speaks of a desire to see more of the same, more of what we've already received. What is that, America? America? 